this is Courtney with Texas Teacher Today. Today I'm going to go over a couple of math problems that I think are very similar to what you're going to see on the real test. And I want to let you know I have weekly tutoring Sunday nights at 8 p.m. Central and I send the recording the same night. So if you're struggling with math, it's a great way to get help each week. Um, so let's look at a couple of questions. Johnny is grilling brats and we'll serve them with tortillas. The brats come in packages of six, but the tortillas come in packages of eight. He wants to buy the smallest amount of each in order to have the same number of each with none left over. How many packages of each should he buy? So to do this, we have to list out the multiples, right? So for brats, he can buy one pack with six, two packs would have 12, three packs would have 18, four packs would have 24, Right? When he buys tortillas, they come in packages of eight. So we would have eight for one pack, 16 with two packs, 24 with three packs. We already have a number in common. We want to have how many the least number with none left over. If he buys four packages of brats and three packages of tortillas, he'll have the right amount. So A is the correct answer. Now let's look at the next um, question. Um, which of the following is used to determine the answer to this question? How many packages of tortillas and how many packages of brats? Well, I listed out the multiples and I found the least common multiple. So the answer is least common multiple. None of the other answers are right. So if you're struggling with questions like this or anything with patterns, with algebra, with geometry, statistics, probability, we practice all of that. We cover one competency each week and I send the recordings. Um, and it comes with access to my course. So if you'd like to join, please give me a call at 361-846-0741. Thanks.